going to finish first and second again, right? They finally get a barone. I've been borrowing a barone. So I'm just going to walk in now and hope that someone actually has a barone to pour because if they don't, I'm fucked. Game Nation just open. Let's go. Guys, I told you guys, we needed to pray. We needed to pray. The Game Nation had the Barone de Four. And guess what? They did, baby. Take my money. Let's go. Who's going to win today? Abdul. Oh, OK. You already know. Yo, Corbin, are you winning today? Uh, I'm going to try. Well, now you're going to try. You're going to destroy everybody. Yeah. That's what, I, that's what I like to hear. Yo, Joey reincarnated. Are you going to win today? No. Yeah, wait, excuse me? I yes, you will. I played this on you trip. You can say what you want. I, I played know this I card on trip. I'm gonna play this card on trip, guys. No, you're not. Yes, I am. You ever see? You ever see what Weevil did to to Exodia? Yeah. You want to see a real life reenaction of it? And the round begins, baby. Let's go. I'm so excited to give you guys commentary here. This is round one. Me versus Abdul. The finals of Last Vlog. My dog. Let's go. Before we get into this, guys, I do want you guys to check out the beautiful the Remy Corp play mats. Look at them, man. They're so beautiful. They're incredible. Here, my Joker gets Imper. My Iris is not being able to be activated, which will hurt me in the future because I can't get me to get Pengraph. So that's a solid Imper there. Here, he's going to also be able to pop that. I go Fiber. He pops Oak, uh, Baylor, Fiber. We're playing through three interruptions here. I go Selene, summon three from extra deck. Now, at this point, I make a mental error. I go popping the back row. I should not have popped the back row. I know the, the deck he's playing. None of the cards affect me. They, they, were, they were blanks. I should have gone for the kill. I literally could have OTK'd if I just went for it, but I didn't. Now here I oppo your talents. I'm like, oh my God, talents just absolutely screws me. And we have to give him the game there. Slight error by popping the back row. Sometimes we're scared of back row, but you guys don't always need to do it. Here, we're gonna go in game two, as you see. I'm going in fiber. Uh, I'm going to set up Dragster, Deg the Fiber uh, with Pengraph. And at this point, it looks good and it is pretty good, but it's susceptible to Gamma Seal, as you see. Gamma Seal, Dark Ruler, stuff like that. This Water Tornado Dragon is just inherently way better. But with the si situation of what I had and how we didn't have much opportunity to, to push further, I'm still okay with that, uh, with that setup. So I still have a Scythe set. So I know that all I got to do is put up a Fiber next turn. So I'm going to, I'm still in a solid position here. I'm aware that he gets to put up his links like this, but this is no problem for me whatsoever. He, I put this, I normal summon, he hand traps the fiber. I'm like, this is totally fine. He has one follow up left, but it's going to get scythed on his turn. So it just doesn't matter. Uh, he's going to cosmic my pen graph. I'm like, man, that, that is very unfortunate, but it's okay. Cause I'm just going to teach you one magician pop. And he hits me with a cosmic. Are you kidding? He's your cosmic. Boys, I've literally never been sacked so hard in my entire <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh career. I don't even know what to say to what just happened. The only card in his entire deck to save his ass was the one Cosmic Cyclone. Oh my god, bro. Yeah, what happened yesterday? Who won yesterday? You're not even gonna win today. Bro, I am You're gonna get clapped up. I literally beat the best. But my boy, Joey. Two I clapped you yesterday. That's a hot bill. Let's go. It doesn't matter. But at least, like, you down bro, three, any three. real racer, ask a real racer. It don't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. A win's a win. <laughs> All right, yo, boys. What skill numbers are you gonna get, though? What skill number has to be one and eight? All right, yo, boys. I was talking me and Abdul just now. I'm gonna get it done, okay? Not today, not tomorrow, but sometime soon. And it gets scales on each of my wrists. How sick would that be? Just blue and red, one and eight. I'm back east, though. That'll be fucking insane. And imagine dropping it on like a regional or YCS, just pen somebody, like pen five, and just show off my. Oh, that would be fucking insane. I would win even if I lost. The fam, you won? No, I lost. Why? <laughs> Wait, aren't you supposed to be in Montreal right now? No. I didn't, my, my team didn't sign up in time. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we are going into round number two now. I must avenge my loss. I'm facing my boy Corbin. Let's go. The same Imperial Order guy. Let's see if he pulls it out at me. I'm caught. I'm going to play this card on trip, guys. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Of course, he pulls the Imperial Order out at me. What the heck? Oh my god, this guy's a prophet. He said he was going to pull it out, and he did. But that's all right, because we got Pen Graph. Let's go. He bricked. He's playing Light Sword over here. He's playing Light Sword with some back row. And uh, unfortunately for him, he, he did brick. But fortunately for me, Pen Best deck. So we're going to go to the OTK here, protected from, uh, protecting from Nibiru, Nibiru with that Palooza. We're going to go into game two over here. 
He's gonna go get Minerva, and guess what, guys? Guess what? I'm gonna play this car on trip, guys. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Not this time, run reboot that shit, run, run reboot that appear loaded. No, 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 no. You are not gonna pull up your loaded at me twice. Run reboot, send that away. Let's go. The rest of my head is not that good. I gotta do a big brain play here to send Oaf to the graveyard. Cause I, I look at my skills, man. I only have I gotta use that lot black bank someone back to souls. I only have Oaf to pen summon and just like that, and that's OTK. Let's go. Alright, yo boys. You guys saw we won that one fast. You still see one fast? We have time to go to the gym. There's an LA fitness nearby here. So I'm gonna go so run to the LA quick. Get a quick chest pump in before the next round. We won in 10 minutes. 10 minutes back. It's close. The LA fitness is just up here. You gotta go. Yeah. Quick chest pump. We're never skipping the gym. Maybe like day. Never chest day. Excuse me. You guys know what LA fitness is? What? LA fitness is around here somewhere. Thank you. Oh, I love Toronto. Nicest people ever. We got to do it. For pendulums. Oh, let's go. It's right here. Jay walk here. Don't kill me. All right, see you guys inside. This shit confusing as hell, boys. I like this somewhere on here. It says it's on the fourth floor. Look at Toronto. All right, boys, we got here. We got LA. We ran here, they're gonna give us a little pass, day pass, something like that, week pass. I'll let you guys know how it is. I'm trying to lift every time, every locals, baby, let's go. I'm already sweating just from that little run. You gotta lift, bro, let's go. We're hitting 205 right now at the bench. I could probably hit 225, probably, but I don't wanna risk it, I don't have a spotter. I'm only gonna be able to record this for you guys. I, my whole workout here, I don't have much time because it's like 20 minutes left for the round. So I'm doing five sets of bench, five sets of incline, and then I'm gonna see if I have time to do flies. And then I'm gonna do some triceps as well, if I have time. I'm gonna push through as much as I can. This shit's easy, bro. I can hit 225, no problem. I'm at two reps here, I believe, three reps. I, I know I can hit five. I've hit five for this plenty of times already. And then I hit four, something like that, easily. And one bad one. The next round started. We finished like five sets of bench, five sets of incline. But the next round started. I didn't even know it got started. I didn't get no email. It just started. So I gotta go run there now. Oh, yeah. breath. I hope I didn't get a game loss. My cardio is so ass. Well, that's it, bro. Trying to get jacked? No days off for nothing. Especially not Yu Gi Oh! I think we made it in time. I see a light at the end of the tunnel. We're almost there, boys. Wow, that was really close. Alright, we made it. Home sweet home. Time for the next round. All right, let's go. So this match over here is against Flunder. It's an incredible match that I'll be showcasing on Patreon. So if you guys want to check this match out, make sure to go check it out down on Patreon, down description below. It, my opponent puts up an incredible board. As you see, he's playing with Dogmaticas in his Flunder deck. And it's very difficult for Pendulum to play around Flunder. It really is. Because Scythe does nothing and our extra deck is not really prepared against it. Especially because everything gets chain blocked. So we do our best here to play around it. We do end up losing, but if you want to see the match, it's an incredible match. You go go check it out on Patreon. Uh, you guys, we got clapped up. Not gonna lie, uh, we today's not going our way, but it's fine. You can't you can't win them all. You can't win them all. Uh, but yo, how's it feel to, to destroy me, bro? Yo, how's it feel to beat the pen god, bro? Yo, you whooped my ass, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. That was that was good. Wonder's a good deck, guys. Wonder's a good good deck. Maybe we have to change the deck a little bit to play it better against it. Right, I extra deck did nothing. Maybe I should have gone Apple. Maybe I should have normal harmonizing instead of the Joker. If you guys remember, but it's all good. We take them with the wins and L's. It's all good because all I know is we're gonna win the next one. But it's all good. We're gonna still stick around and see who's gonna win this one. Maybe we'll do a deck profile then. Let's go. I just overheard something. Yo, what'd you just say you did? Uh, not infirm Ecclesia. You infirm Ecclesia. Oh my god. Oh my Dude, you god. Dude, you get players and reading, bro. Like it's yes. hard. There's no greater, greater combo in the world than those two. Yo, Abdul. Yo. Yo. So you already know what it is. I'm fucking X2. So you're gonna have to be the star of the show now, bro. Come on, Every single. Your XO, there's only one round to go, okay? I told you, bro. The second I passed you, you were the finals. You were literally the finals before the locals <laughs> even started. Let's go. <laughs> and now that you're the only one left, everyone, every single person watching this vlog right now is cheering you on. You um, must win this should. tourney. As they fucking should. As they should. So don't take no prisoners. I don't care who you face. I'll be right there. 
I already, I'm X2, so I'm gonna face a buy. I'll be done in five minutes. And then when that's done, I'm gonna come to you and I'm gonna make sure you win, all right? Guys, we're X2, we can't top, but we're playing this one up for fun. We're facing off against Invoke Dogma Shadal. This is gonna be a very interesting matchup. A lot of people have trouble with this matchup. So I'll be showcasing you guys exactly how to win, especially when you're playing the best deck. Because obviously when you're playing the best deck, every matchup's free. Blunder is a little difficult, I'm not gonna lie, but I will show, like, you guys can see the match on Patreon to see where I, I uh, screwed up for the last one. So here, my opponent got the whole Macabo Maximus setup. He's all good. A uh, little thing to note here, okay? This is a very important lesson. You guys are gonna catch this on. Is don't send the Dweller there. We, I should have sent the Appaloosa. If I sent the Appaloosa, now my Axis Kotaka is a free banish. This is very important. Tips like that, I have on Metafy coaching. You guys want to check the description below or Patreon, so make sure to check those out. And here, I'm going to go... Uh, he, he actually forgets to set Shadal Shism. Um, like, I, I recognize he forgot to set it. If he just told me, like, yo, can I set it? I'd be like, yeah, bro, no problem. It's just locals. But he didn't mention anything, so I was like, okay. Uh, so here, I'm going to do a big brain play. We go Ignister. The reason behind the Ignister is that I need to get the pen graph off. I'm under pen call. The only way to pop it is my own Ignister. Shuffle his card back. I want to set up my pen graph. I'm going to try and clear as much uh, as cards as I can. I also want to set up Scythe so I don't get hit with uh, cards on his turn. I want to set up Baronis as well. I know he's going to shut off Fusion Me. He protected his Macabre with Alistair. But the second the resolution of Construct, I'm going to go resolve my Fiber to pop my Scythe. He's going to want to shut off Dragon Pop, but that's okay because I'm going to get some sends off of myself with the Pengraph. Boom. Get those up, and now we're all good to go. So, now that he's stopped with Scythe, that Baronis is going to be able to use Construct Effect to set, uh, negate that. This is totally fine. He has Secret Village. I have no cards in hand, but you're going to see the power of Pendulums. I have no cards in hand, no nothing, just two scales. That's all I got. And just like that, I'm going to be able to pen five. I'm going to pen someone here, and this is just going to be easy game. I'm going to go time start to get Joker. And uh, overall, it's just going to be OTK here with Black Pen popping, harmonizing going back in scale. will be enough for game. And I end up taking the match as well. Pen best deck. Let's go. Uh, Welcome, Charles. You played a shit ton of hand shots and Nadir Servant and your Dogmatic Shrek. One day we'll actually pull something good with these packs. I'm actually playing. Okay, guys, so here's what we're gonna do now. We're gonna, my boy Thomas gave us free entry the last time. Remember, you guys, he gave us his spot. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go take my store credit that I won the other day with, and I'm gonna go get him seven packs of Synchro Storm, and I'm gonna pull him a Baron de Floor right now. Let's go. Yo, Thomas. Yo, what's up? Yo, yesterday, uh -huh. I won the tournament because of you. You gave oh, yeah. me your entry of out course. of yourself. You didn't even play. You did that for me. Mm hmm. So out of respect to my boy Thomas, these seven packs, oh my God. they're for you, bro. I hope we you pull you a Baron de Floor. I don't care, bro. You're fucking, it was incredible that you did that. It warmed my heart. It was absolutely beautiful. And now, out of these seven packs, bro, we're I guarantee you. We're getting the floor. We're getting the floor. And then once we do, we're going to build gonna you pendulums, bro. That's, that's what we're going to do. That's, that's what we're going to do. Let's go. Baron de Floor. Everyone watching this, if you're watching this right now in the comments, Scream on my boy! Cheer him on! Goku Spear Bomb Energy right now! Give me your energy, boys. We need Let's the Baron de Floor. We need the Baron de Floor. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're close, we're close. It's coming because it's floor. <laughs> we'll get there soon, we're guys. It? We're feeling it? We got this, we got this. I don't even want this, like, for myself. I never wanted it more for anyone other than my boy Thomas right now. I never cared for it before. I just want my boy to get one so he can build pendulums. Okay. I guess that's okay. Hey, also, a side note is you could also probably have like half a Lyrilux deck and half a Speedroid deck. <laughs> oh, an Ultra. Let's go. Let's go. Not bad. Not bad. Still not the Ultra we're looking for, though, but it's still not bad nonetheless. I've uh, ruined the floor one time. Baron the floor it's one time. It's in this one. It's in this one. I'm feeling it. Oh, yo. Come on, come on, Baron de Four. Come at me, Baron de Four. Alright, oh, we got this, guys. We got this. This is it. It's the last pack, bro. Alright, Abdul said it's the last pack. It's the last pack. It's the last pack for sure. I believe. Yeah. I know, bro. Pray, bro. Pray. Ah! We tried, bro. We tried. We tried. We tried. Hey, at least you got an ultra. Hell yeah. Let's go. Not bad. Yo, what's up, everyone? I want to show you guys a quick Flunder deck profile from the opponent that destroyed me that round that you guys remembered. 
So what's your name, bro? And uh, uh, Sam. what are you going to show? Sam? Uh, Flunder, yeah. Free standard stuff. All right, let's okay. see it. So through Arbina, best card yes. in the deck. One card combo. Uh, Eaglin, partner in crime. Two Strix, one Toucan, one Barrier Statue. For the small bursts is all you need. Okay, for big birds, you got one M Pen, one Snull, one Ryza, and one Avion. These all come up with different matchups. This is really good. People are cutting this. I don't know why. And this card. They obviously cut this? Yeah. Good. Tell them, bro. Card You're card the Thunder up. God, bro. Tell them. Bro, bro, this comes up like often. Yeah, good, good, good. Okay, so for the Thunder spells, three map, second best card in the deck. Then uh, this, this card's really good. You can not like Tikaboo and stuff. And uh, this broken, you search this on off uh, M Pen every time. It's just nice. Nuts. Yeah. Okay, enough for the Dogmatica stuff. Three Nadir. Ooh. Two punishment and, uh, and every version needs to play this. Um, it's optional. It I don't play. It. I, I play it, but I don't play D shifter. I like. Cool. I prefer this over D shifter. Nice. I think it's more utility. Nice, nice. So then for pot cards, three extra, three duality. Um, These nice. cards are freaking crazy, really especially good. this one. Really Book of Moon. You. This is the best. This is like one of the best cards in the deck. It dodge on the. So you go first. Yeah. You uh you can dodge Infib and uh Valor, and then if you go second, you can trade up for Negate. Nice. Really nice. good. Then for one of the spells, Gold Sark, this gets your Argent going, banishes any card, and then call because you can't really get hand trapped. Yeah. For hand traps, three Ash, and then best hand trap of the format, Ogre. Ogre. Okay, nice. nice. Any last words you want to say about your deck that destroyed the Pengar? Um, I don't know. Deck's pretty good. Don't underestimate <laughs> it. Also, if you're playing against a deck, side drill, side Lancia, side Zombie World, just win for free. Nice. All right, let's go. All right. All right, guys, that ends the vlog now. As you guys know, I finished X2. I'm cool. Who won? Who else, bro? Who else? <laughs> Let's go, dude. Clock them all up. 4 0. What you win today? Fucking shitty ass synchro storm. Fucking shit. That's if you got 20 star credit as well. The box is still done. That's solid. But yeah, what's gonna happen? Uh, we're coming back here Wednesday, right? Yeah, yeah, Wednesday. Yeah, you're gonna clock everyone? Like, yeah, no, he's not I'm gonna destroy him. I'm gonna get my revenge, bro. Let's go. Bro, you better hope you dodge me. Nah, uh, I'm gonna go get my revenge. We're 1-1 one, one now in the finals. Guys, it's cold out here. This is Canada, this is Toronto. Fuck it's Canada, bro. Very, I love Canada, but fuck the winter. Very cold. If you guys are planning to randomly move to Toronto, well, it's all up here. If you guys are pr randomly planning to move here, I would recommend doing it in like summertime. Yeah. This is actually some absolute ass weather. But it's all good. Because Pat Mazda, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.